Hey guys, today I'm going to briefly show you how to uh, separate and um, cut your chicken for smoker or for grill. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you have a cutting board that's designated for raw meats, raw products. You want to have a pan to put your chicken in. Uh, you want to have a little baggie with um, you know, something to hold the fat or the excess you know, skin and bones that you would trim off of it. Over here, I season my chicken with triple nine, what the cluck for my barbecue. Um, <clears throat> first thing I wanna start off by doing is putting an edge on the knife. This is not a sharpening tool, it's just to put an edge on the knives. Most of the knives are sharpened already, you just wanna put an edge, so you wanna go like so, just giving it a nice rub to get the, get the edge back on. Next, you wanna make sure you're wearing gloves because some people don't like to handle chicken with their bare hands because they will answer their phone and they're inclined to do other things around the house. Uh, if you wear gloves, you can easily take them off and go do what you need to do, so on and so forth. So the first thing I do is lay the chicken down, look for excess you know skin all the excess skin and fat you want to trim those down then when you flip the thigh over you will see that there's a line right here a line of fat right here that separates the thigh from the leg so <clears throat> you would take your knife like so and you go down and there you go it comes right off so the next thing I like to do is because this skin right here is um, you know, covering most of the actual flesh of the chicken. I like to do a little scoring. You know, nothing major, just put a, a scoring line with the knife on there. That will allow seasoning and smoke or the grill flavor to penetrate the meat. So, put that like so. And this part, give it a nice little score. And you would do this and repeat this with all the other chicken product. Same thing, write down, give it a nice score in a couple places, remove excess fats from the skin. If there's any feathers, you would remove some of that feather off of it. And again, you're always looking for excess fat and feathers on your chicken. Nice score mark there. So if you guys are interested in chicken rubs or any type of barbecue rub, <clears throat> you can easily go on Amazon and look for, you know, competition style rub that will give you some of the, some of the, uh, competition rubs that we use in the circuit or I use, I use them in the, in the cafe as well for you guys. I make sure that whatever I do in the competition, I make sure I bring that to the cafeteria so you guys can enjoy that same flavor, profile, or type of product and quality of product that we do on competitions, which are judged by judges from all over the USA, professional judges. So again, I'm removing all fat and excess fat and excess skin. If there's any feathers, I'm trimming that off as well. So this is an easy step. A lot of people that buy chicken tend to just um, take it out of the package and they put seasoning on it. Uh, you should wash your chicken first and before you wash it and dry it with a, with a uh, paper towel. Try not to use cloth towels when you are dealing with raw chicken because it actually, the, the, the meat actually stays in the fiber of the cloth and um, you don't want to contaminate your, um, the other things you want to wipe down with the cloth or so on and if you do that you designate that one towel for the whole you know for the task which is you know 
cleaning chicken. If, in case you need to wipe your hand or the knife or something. So what I do, I just take a roll of paper towel and, you know, disposable towel and that's easiest for me and I would not contaminate, you know, my towels and so on. So, like so. Nice score marks on those. And a lot of people, you know, use thighs to cook. Um, it's a little economical and the best part about cooking with thighs, it's always moist. It's, it keeps this moisture and it has a little more flavor than the breast. But if you're a health connoisseur and you want to, you know, eat breast or something healthier, I, I would go with the, with the chicken breast and that you would do the same thing. You would remove the the breast, the, the uh, skin and the fats from the breast. Here we go, I'm gonna change gloves. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna season my chicken and get it ready for, to go into the smoker or on a grill. And that's the step that I'm doing today is I'm showing you how to cut chicken, clean chicken, and get it ready for a smoker or a grill. And as you see, I just changed my gloves because now I'm going to grab my seasoning and <clears throat> I didn't want to use that the chicken hand with the chicken, you know, smell and uh, chicken parts on it. So what I, what I do now is I'm going to flip the chicken thigh and I'm using this hand for the chicken, this hand for the rub. So I will flip that chicken around and then lightly dust. This is called dusting. Lightly dust the inner part of the chicken thigh where <clears throat> we call the... Uh, this is not this is not the presentation side. This is the inner part where most of the flavor is infused, and you just give it a light dusting. And the same with the thigh. Give it a light dusting and flip it around. And you don't have to move as slow as I'm moving, but you know, at your leisure, at your pace. So now that I have that part done, I'm going to dust the top of the other side. So you're not handling the chicken so many times. You're just doing one side, and then you are dusting the other side with this triple nine, what the clock, chicken rub. This is what I use for my competitions, and I use this at the restaurant, the catering, restaurant, catering, cafe, any, anything I, whenever I use chicken, this is what I use for my rubs. So now this is ready. This is how you will season your meat and just give it a good, you know, 10 minutes to absorb some of that salt. You'll see it start to look a little bit wet and um, it's ready to go on to the grill or your smoker.